Hello everyone, we're just gonna head into Dollar Tree. I noticed that there's less this year than in previous years. This heart actually grabbed my attention. It is so similar in style to what I created a couple years ago. These are the metal picks, but you can cut the pick off and use them as decor for other placements. They have the table scatter and there's actually hearts in here. Little heart jewels. Some of you had watched my previous walkthrough and were asking that I focus in closer on the little figurines because it's hard to see. So I hope that this here allows you a better view. Look at the little beehive, so cute. The little stands, the little gnomes, the little fairies. They just have a ton of things. These are cute chubby birds and there's the little ice cream truck but the chubby birds i repurposed last year look at the little truck the little green tractor i should say they had some other farmhouses at the other location this one has the camper and the frog ah see they had these and this one the red farm house they had like a little chicken coop this one's really cute the farm the barn yeah anyways these are some of the things that they have some things seem to be selling better than others and i did this one here this was my favorite birdie last year and i repurposed it made it look like plaster these would be cute even for easter as little carrots maybe with a little mini bunny or something like that super cute the valentine's day napkins are what's sold really quick. So these are heart shaped and these are only out now for the season. Here are the Valentine's Day card sets. And I feel like certain stores have, you know, different styles. The ribbon, did I miss the ladybug print last time? I tend to forget after you see things sometimes. I know the checkered one here is clearly gone or the plaid one I should say was red and white. I wanted to see the wood, but then a bunch of people came in. So here are the wood hearts. And I really like the top style. It's way up high. It's so pretty. There's, they just brought some of the party supplies. So yeah, I don't think I recall seeing the troll set or some of these other ones. These were out for Christmas, but now they've been moved into the Valentine's Day setup, which is cute. These are awesome. Really pretty. What a great value. And the paper straws with the little heart prints in metallic and these are like a silicone heart silicone these are new glittery heart this one's my love and be mine are you a fan of these a little moped so cute anyways do you like these or something that you would use as your home decor they have some really pretty bags right now these are new compared to last year and there was a lot of glitter and then they have these marble i guess they're wine bags but you can use them for lotions or rolled up magazine different things as gifts right they have these boxes as well Has anyone repurposed these hearts into the decor? There's the little storage bins, but I'm wondering about the heart shape, if you've done anything with it. Oh, these are new this year as well. Some different sayings on them. They're sweet. And light pink. These are really cute because they're the little LED light up and not just a faux floral. So pretty. These are really high up, but there's a red tractor, a blue, and a pink one. You can't see them. So as you turn the corner from Valentine's, there are Easter bunnies. And these are so beautiful. They're actually very plushy and soft. Probably the best quality I've seen in a very long time. And the eyes are safe. 
So maybe for a little pet or for a, uh, a child, they seem to be very safe. They have some Valentine socks here. I had spotted some with little trolls, but I don't see any here. They were at a different store. A little Valentine's, a little Easter, and a little St. Patrick's. These are five pots in a package. Here are some of their seasonal socks for St. Patrick's. The gnome. Oh, the cat's cute. It's like the angry cat. And some doggies. This end cap here has some items I've never seen at our regular grocery store. So the creamy tomato is really expensive elsewhere, but I have never seen these like spreads or preserves. This one is an apple and maple, and then you have raspberry. Has anyone tried this? And if you have, do you cook, have you cooked with it or just spread it on toast? And then they have these Katie Boosts. You've got jalapeno and poutine flavor. And they have this giant family, Katie family size compared to the regular. They even have French onion soup, which is not usually something I see. And they have these flavors of Katie. I love the look of these. They're ceramic. I just wish they were a tad deeper because then I could use them as makeup brush holders or a pen holder on my desk. And I know a lot of you have been searching for the ring dishes like these, but I'm always fully stocked here. Take a quick browse at some of the picture frames. Some of you love being able to purchase them here and using them for DIYs or displaying pictures, of course, and stuff. But anyways, these are new. So they typically sell at Ikea, I think, for $5, if I'm not mistaken, or $2.99. I can't remember if it's $3 or $2.99 or $4.99, but they have two colors here. They have like an off-white and that kind of greeny-gray. It isn't glass, though. It's just the plastic. You can make a menu with them. There's different things you can use them for. These are the wall decals, but nothing really stands out to me here. These are new. They're like a pegboard. Oh, they're fun. My state of mind, today's mood, or today's mindset. And then my frame of mind. And then so it comes with a stand on the back and little pegs as well that you can insert. Just a little bit of a interactive thing and these I think are fairly new as well they're in the shape of a purse they're really high up sometimes things are so high up it's hard for me to show you these are new the marquee lights they're the small versions of which we normally see the large ones so the unicorn the cloud but normally we see a lot larger these are also new I guess maybe kind of like a valentine's day line my heart your heart happily ever after looks like there's one out in the back yep they're the same the ring and the heart and their ceramic as well what else is here oh look at this i was asking for a long piece of rectangular wood and yay these are really nice and solid i don't know if i should grab should i grab the two and just repurpose them well, maybe just the one and then they have these I think I have a little spring DIY that I would like to do, so we'll work with some of these. What else is here? I love the little ring holders. There's a little cat dish. So cute. And then they have these that come in a pack, right? things over so there's two pieces of wood in here but be mindful that you're getting a good piece of wood there's a lot of stuff here in front so i'm just going to share these are new and i wanted you to see them because they're the little bird cutouts 
and also the branch. And then, no, these have been around. Oh, these are from Christmas or the Santa. And there's some of these as well if you need wood, which is a great value. But yeah, there's a bunch of boxes here, so we'll just get a little look over top of them. I know some of you were asking if there was any new dishware. So as for mugs, I don't see anything new yet. Maybe in the coming weeks, we'll start to see the spring line. Um, they have leftovers from Christmas, and this is all that I see here. a little heads up that these can be found on the end of one of your end caps nowhere near the craft supplies so just in case you're looking for them well that's a pretty good indicator one of Dollar Tree's top sellers right now is probably chips lots of storage is available which is amazing and they have these new bins they're round with the little grids they're so pretty i really like them and then they have the square kind of storage but i want to share with you the other colors that are available as well and some new styles you can see here they have a navy blue a bit darker as you can tell and that color it's coming through a little more purpley on my end but it's really quite nice this one here it's a nice deep blue i love these i actually bought one in a pale pink and they don't have any here but yeah so there's some awesome storage i can't recall but i feel like we had seen the ac packages a few months ago I don't know if it was these exact crepe paper or scrapbook paper as you could call it but um, yeah there's some really awesome sets here though if you're doing pocket letters if you want to take a look at some paper crafts I'll link them down in the description below it just gives you some ideas on what to create using pretty paper and these ones here have stickers so again awesome for basic scrapbooking or I mean scrapbooking pages but then you can also use paper for other crafts right i apologize someone is asking what markers i've used in my cricut and these work really well they fit into the slots and they work and they write nicely i actually did a diy not too long ago using one of them oh and here's some more of the colorful zebra pens I'm gonna leave you with a little bit of footage from a previous walkthrough just to showcase all of the garden accessories or fairy garden accessories. And there's so much here on this display that I didn't share with you in my current walkthrough. Again, maybe because things were already sold, but I hope you enjoyed walking through Dollar Tree with me. I look forward to sharing some more walkthroughs and some hauls with you in the very near future. Until next time, everyone, thank you so very much for watching. Bye for now.